sound has been in existence before life came in. And in fact, it's because of sound that life came in. Now, the Big Bang Theory has proven that the existence of life came in when there was a huge collusion and the collusion which came in created the sound, a big sound. And that sound is the primordial sound which created life, right from the single cell life to the most complicated human system. And to understand this further, you can read the book Power of Sound because it's a whole thing which we cannot probably cover in this time. Now when the, so the sound in the body, that is when you're vibrating at the right frequency, you understand that each and every energy portal in the body is resonating to the right vibration. And where every portal, that is the chakra in the body, has its measurability with regards to how much it can accept in the form of electricity, that's the portal. Just like when we charge a mobile, we need to have a slot where we can plug in and we can draw in the energy to charge the battery. So human body also is like a mobile and to charge it, we need to plug in somewhere. And if the earthing is not right, we are going to have a short circuit. So the short circuits are in the form of all those emotional traumas, all those mental issues, and then turning into physical issues. Because 97% of all physical issues, that's the illnesses and sicknesses which are found in the human body are only due to the mental or the emotional imbalances. So we have to look at how we can tune ourselves. And just like the guitar, let me take the example of guitar. If any of the strings of the guitar was not tuned well, how would the music be? It would become noise. It wouldn't be music anymore. And the same way, the human body is also a musical instrument. It's got its seven strings and many, many micro strings because we have millions of cells in the body. So these strings have to be tuned well to what we need to manifest in our life. You want good health? You should know where, which, where it is not okay and what needs to be tuned in. If it is manifestation of your relationships, you should know which string to be tuned in. And if it is money, we need to know which string needs to be tuned in. So I hope all of you are with me with regards to these strings. <laughs> Lovely. Now, I, uh, how many of you love music? All of us, right? Did anybody tell you that you should love music? Did somebody say, no, no, you have to listen to this song and you have to love, love music? It is something which is from within, right? And that withinness, that internal reflection, which a human body does it on its own, right from a little child, mama sings the lullaby. Because that connect, that voice of hers, which the child has heard even when it was in the womb, allows the child to connect and tune in the strings. There is something called as a garbha sanskar with music. And I do that extensively because we want to see the next generation beautifully blooming without the chaos of life. All of you would like to have your children happy? You would like to see the next generation happy? Right? So all of us are here, not for a day, but through us, they live on. So this is the human body, and you can see the various colors, the chakras associated to it. And based on that, we can have a tuna. The body is held together by sound, and the presence of diseases indicates that some sounds have gone out of tune. 